this effing closure. <laughs> what the hell are you guys doing? <laughs> Five singles in just three days. I haven't been able to listen to the second one yet. You guys already dropped five. But uh, before we get into it, uh, let's hang on a little bit and I will really, like talk about this more in depth. Let's go. Disclosure is a UK band which consists of uh, Guy and Howard Lawrence. They create um, dance music, like house music, uh, the, the elements of synth pop, and uh, it's really unique experience. Like their music is really fantastic. I enjoyed their uh, both studio albums. Uh, first is Subtle, second one is Caracal, and. Uh, dope like really amazing music I when I discovered them uh, it was like a treasure because like wow like this new sounds like this is so perfect uh, this is not your typical EDM uh, DJs although I had, don't have any problems with EDM DJs and I do listen to them often but uh, this is just like a kind of different genre even like different style different uh, chemistry going on in music uh, with, between these guys. So these guys came back after hiatus of two years and gosh, they're dropping singles after singles, singles after singles, like just in three days. Uh, like, okay, two days ago, two days ago, right? I was just hanging out with my family in the evening and all of a sudden I got a notification that uh, they dropped a new track. I was like, oh damn, I'm excited. And I have listened to it uh, without a reaction. I, and, but then I was like, I felt guilty. I really want to uh, show uh, to the world that I really like Disclosure. And um, I, when I searched reaction videos of Disclosure, there aren't many at all, it's especially for this new uh, tracks, like there isn't one. So I want to be the first who actually put some love out there for Disclosure. The next day comes in and the track actually drops but I was talking my ex and uh, uh, neither I got back to uh, reacting to this track nor I got back with my ex <laughs> yet. <laughs> and today I was actually just casually watching YouTube videos by casually explained channel. <laughs> yes, as you can see I'm very busy. <laughs> and I receive another notification of Disclosure's new track. So we have like five singles to react to. So let's stop wasting no more time. Disclosure. We are starting with the track Moonlight just because I wanted to listen to it on camera again. Uh, I did listen to, by the way, Ultimatum, which dropped a little earlier as well. Uh, nice track. But I actually enjoyed Moonlight more, and we're gonna listen to Moonlight right now. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> this is the sound you want to listen to. Let's go. Yes. <laughs> yeah, that's so awesome, man. Uh, the only thing is like uh, I'm confused like throughout this track there's only one word you can hear and it's like uh, I thought since the track is titled Moonlight they're saying Moonlight but more and more I hear it's like I hear like real love kind of thing um, so I'm not sure to be honest let me know in the comments below if you have heard that track and know what they're talking about uh, but let's get into where angels fear to tread I've heard that they sampled um, older song like from 80s apparently it's really well-known song but I I've never heard of it unfortunately 
but it's really interesting um, sample and the the chops the chops they did for this track uh, is already like so far it's already uh, very interesting. I want to dance with someone like this is a really perfect song to dance some well I wouldn't say waltz but basically have a slow dance you know with someone. Jazz implementations, definitely. I liked it. Um, it was simple. I wouldn't say that I will be playing this very much, but if uh, Disclosure's new album will uh, drop, uh, which I'm, I'm, I'm really hoping that it will happen soon, since they're like <laughs> dropping <laughs> back to back the singles. I I will be listening to this track, of course, I will not be skipping and it's gonna be a good experience uh, with uh, the rest of the tracks but as a single, like as a standout um, not much um, it's just like a song to well, um, the Moonlight as well actually but Disclosure is known for this uh, just fantastic instrumental um, it's really nice for me, especially for example when uh, great vocalists or the, the artist you know comes in and features the song adds uh, sauce and flavor to the track but this kind of tracks is also um, they're fire they're incredible so um, if I if but if they're not in the album you know if I'm not listening to compilation of these tracks is one separate track is kind of like uh, a little bit hard to come back to I would say so disclosure, uh, the reason I'm saying all this is because I, I just want a new album, please. <laughs> We're waiting on that fourth studio effort. <laughs> the fourth because the third one I didn't really enjoy, it was just like a three track EP, but the other two albums, as I said, I really enjoy, I really, really love them. And the song we're gonna uh, listen to now is Love Can Be So Hard. Hold on, they're all different in styles and this one is completely different from what we heard so far. I, I don't remember um, implementations like this in Disclosure's music, like the sample is pretty dope and so interesting and like out of, out of Disclosure's world, you know, because Disclosure don't, haven't done this before. <laughs> sort of 90s funk. Disclosure is striking upon us with dope 90s funk. the disco ball in here and so that like the colors will be changing in this room and some glasses probably as well <laughs> or in some afro um, haircut you know what else I thought I think disclosure songs can easily be used as lounge songs you know like the songs you put in the bar and just relax and have fun and bars actually do use disclosure uh, tracks uh, I mean, not every single one in the world, but yeah, Disclosure's tracks are really a handful to create a pretty nice vibe uh, in the clubs, in the bars, and uh, people, of course, they uh, do it, they put it on, 
and uh, other people <laughs> they enjoy it. Um, the reason why I'm saying this is because uh, it's for the question of hey like is it worth going back to this track because like we listen to a different kind of uh, music um, maybe more mainstream or maybe obscure uh, music that you listen to that nobody else listens to uh, I would say if you haven't heard Disclosure you have not heard this kind of style of music so I would really recommend you to uh, listen to some tracks by Disclosure, maybe not this ones if you haven't uh, liked this one uh, by this reaction yet but um, songs like White Noise by Disclosure or Latch or Magnets uh, this kind of tracks you really want to check them out they're really adorable and uh, I, w I didn't say who are uh, the features um, for White Noise it's Aluna George for uh, Latch is Sam Smith legend in the game and of course we have uh, Lourdes for the song Magnus and uh, there are more uh, cool features if you want to check out like uh, The Weeknd even uh, he sings on Disclosure's track Nocturnal um, it's just some suggestions I'm giving to you <laughs> okay uh, go check them out for sure but we're not done yet you can do it later <laughs> I uh, want to also listen to uh, the last uh, handful of tracks we have left with Funky Sensation, which features Gwen McRae. So let's check it out. <laughs> okay, I, I really like this vocals. Oh, bring it on. Let's forget that there's a space between the second. Can you feel it? <laughs> yeah, it's like with the vocals, it's just, it's still better. Uh, not in every track, because before, as I said, like on those two albums I enjoy, like there are tracks which are perfect just as an instrumental. But uh, for example, out of these five tracks, I would have wished to have like three tracks with vocals and two instrumental let's say but we have four instrumental tracks and one only which has feature which was funky sensation we just heard and the last one we will go to is where you come from i'm from uzbekistan by the way <laughs> it's in asia this reminds me of like clubs of 2000s so, you know, that, that sound of house 2007 this year, maybe like 2005 even. Yep, definitely. <laughs> it's like a throwback to, to 2000s. But it has like African drums into it? Too, actually, you needed that um, transition to something else as well. Like because if the whole track was like this, um, it would have been less interesting. But I'm glad that it's nice. <laughs> Instrumental is like going right now. Here we we go. Cool, and that's been five tracks by Disclosure in the single session. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna end this video because uh, like damn uh, it's been a, <laughs> a long video. Tell me what tracks did you like out of these five songs? Uh, did you listen to it yet without 
me or uh, like have you ever heard of Disclosure uh, before this video let me know also uh, Disclosure fans if you are here please let me know as well comment below uh, Disclosure fan and then heart yeah, that's gonna be cool I wanna see how many Disclosure fans out there I'm um, sorry for that and <laughs> um, yeah just uh, hopefully you will check out Disclosure if you haven't yet uh, and uh, I'm I'm pleased. I'm pleased when I'm here. Um, although this is a little bit different from disclosure, I wanted some um, more uh, vocalists on the tracks, uh, more features. But hopefully the upcoming album will deliver that. But other than that, um, the dope instrumental tracks, um, you know, uh, which are like disclosure are famous for, they're here. We got it. So. Uh, <laughs> no other complaints. I'll see you guys in the next videos. Please hit the like button if you like this video. Subscribe to this channel. Um, and yeah, I'll see you guys in the next videos. <laughs> Goodbye.